Matt and Mal, your relationship is something I look up to and aspire to imitate in my own relationship on a daily basis. As I look around the room tonight, I see a room full of people you have positively impacted as individuals and as a couple. I couldn't be happier to celebrate this new chapter with y'all. Do you remember it? Cause I know I do We'd spend our summers in the wildflowers Dancing in the rain for hours All we knew was how to have some fun We heard, we heard about Mallory uh, probably before your first date, I think. I think you had your, your, your sights set on her. And Julie and I had a conversation one night and we knew uh, that this was, this was the one. And uh, Mallory is, has been an incredible blessing in our lives. We love you very much. Mallory, you're the most kind, gentle soul that I've ever been around. I just want you to know how much I love you and how much I love the man that you're marrying. I, I just can't wait to enjoy the years to come. counts in making a happy marriage is not so much how compatible you are, but how you deal with incompatibility. My hope and wish for you on your marriage journey is that you guys will remember and cherish and celebrate the good times together, like trips to Scotland and Croatia. Come to appreciate the mundane times, like a nightly bowl of popcorn together, and fall even deeper in love as you grow through the difficult times together. A marriage, as most of us understand it, is a voluntary and full commitment. It is made in the deepest sense to the exclusion of all others, and it is entered into with the desire and hope that it will last for life. Be devoted to one another in love. Honor one another above yourselves. A marriage is just that, a full devotion to one another and a commitment to each other above all other relationships. Mallory, when I think of the last three years with you, I think of pure happiness, adventure, and endless laughs. I cannot wait to grow with you, to continue to challenge each other, and most importantly, to keep each other young. I promise to love you as a wife, as a best friend, and as a forever partner for the rest of our lives. Matthew, there are a million things I love about our relationship, but the one I love the most is our friendship. I vividly remember thinking to myself, the girl who gets to marry Matt is going to be so incredibly lucky. Little did I know I would be standing in front of you today being that lucky girl. I promise to keep our lives exciting, full of passion, and with as many adventures and concerts as possible. But more importantly, I promise to put us and our love first in all that we do. Matthew Pumphrey, I love you with all my heart, and I can't wait to share an incredible life together. By the power vested in me by the Universal Life Church, it is my honor to declare you <laughs> husband and wife. Matt, you may kiss your bride. beyond your years and I look up to you in every single way. Your caringness and your sensitivities for people is honorable. You are my person I come to for all of my advice. Seeing the friend you are and the friendships that you've created makes me jealous at times and has me always wanting to emulate you in my life. Pump, you bring a joy to my sister I haven't seen from anyone else. Your eagerness in pursuing Mal from early on showed evidence of how much you care for her. I'm so happy for the both of you. It's an amazing feeling just being a part of this and uh, y'all should feel amazing too because 
These are just two incredible people. Everybody raise a glass. I'm excited my best friend's got his best friend. I love you guys. Cheers. But I wouldn't ask for more.